Uh, Joseph, I'm bored. What do you want to do? Uh, I don't know, dude, but I'm kind of hungry. You want to eat Play-Doh? Oh, yeah, dude. Pass me a cup. Uh, what flavor do you want? I got chocolate, strawberry, blueberry, blackberry, and privilege. Oh, give me a cup of that privilege. I've been dying for some white privilege. Uh, okay, I'll get you the privilege. Here you go. Uh, oh, there yeah. it is. And I think I'm going to get uh, blackberry. Oh, you know what they say. Once you go black, you never go back. Why do they say that? Oh, I think that's Cody. Come on. Oh, okay. Uh, hello? Hey, Junior. Uh, hey, Cody, what's up? Me and Joseph are about to eat Play-Doh. Oh, you guys get Play-Doh? Yeah, we got a lot of flavors still left over. Me and Joseph already chose. Wait, you already picked flavors? Please tell me somebody didn't already pick White Privilege. <sighs> Joseph already got the White Privilege. Mm-hmm. Damn it. Well, dude, you always get White Privilege. Yeah, it's just so good. Well, no. Cody, what's that thing in your hand? Uh, that's my wand. Oh, no, the, the other thing. Oh, oh, let me come in and I'll show you. All right, come on in, Cody. Mm. So, Joseph, how's that Play-Doh? Oh, dude, it's delicious. I already feel like I can get pulled over by the cops without getting shot. Yeah, that, that's what's so great about it. Mm -hmm. All right, Cody, what is this thing? Well, you see, Junior, I live about nine miles away from your house, and I have to walk here every day. What? You walk nine miles to get to my house? Why don't you get a bike? Well, I have a bike, but it doesn't have a seat. But that's fine, because I usually just ride it anyway. But then my tire popped, because I like to ride it down a lot of bumpy roads with a lot of rocks, because I like to feel it bounce up and down. So I made this machine. I have one exactly like it in my bedroom. You see, it lets me teleport between my house and here. Well, this, this thing can teleport from my house to your house? Uh, that'd be so cool. Uh, does it work? Uh, I don't know. I've never actually gotten the chance to try it. Oh, hold on. Let's try it out with a Play-Doh. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, Cody, you're going to test out your teleporter with this Play-Doh. Okay, Junior, I have to get the remote. It won't work without the remote. Okay, get the remote. Um, where, where is that remote? Uh, Ken, where's the remote? Wait, Ken, it's not under there. Ah, oh, damn it, I think I left the remote in my room. Well, well, then go get it. Well, Junior, I live nine miles away. Well, then why don't you get your mom to teleport it for you? Teleport the remote here. Junior, my mom is stupid. All right, fine, I guess I'll call her. <sighs> What's wrong, Cody? She's not going to do it right, Junior. Of course she's going to do it right. All you have to do is tell her to teleport the remote using the machine you made. Just tell her that. Junior, it's not that easy. It's going to be easy. Just tell her, Cody. All right, fine. It's ringing. Hello? Is this my beautiful baby boy? Yeah, yeah, Mom. It's me. Look, I need you to do me a favor, okay? Okay. I do anything for my Codykins. I love him so much. Okay, yeah, that's great, Mom. I, look, I need you to go in my room and look in the top drawer of my dresser. Can you do that? But, but Cody, it says no girlies are allowed in your room. Yeah, I know, I know that, Mom, but I, I just, I'm gonna make a one-time exception, okay? I need you to do that. Uh, okay, Cody, I'm there. Uh, okay, Mom, now, I need you to look in the top drawer and try to find a remote, okay? If you see anything that isn't a remote, please do not touch it. Uh, oh, Cody, I found a little Rudolph nose in here. Uh, 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 uh yeah. Yeah, yeah, Rudolph, Rudolph knows. Yep, that, that's, that's Rudolph. Uh, uh, oh, Cody, and I found a little whip so you can whip the reindeer, too. Uh, 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 yeah, 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 th those, those naughty reindeer, they, they don't listen. They, they just like to play. Uh, the, the remote, Mom, do you, do you see the remote? Oh, 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 Cody, there's some fuzzy handcuffs in here for when you play cops and robbers. Yeah, 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 cop, cops and robbers, cop, cops and robbers. Uh, okay, Mom, do, do you see the remote or not? Uh, uh, oh, oh, Cody. There's a big old chess piece in here, and it's kind of stinky. Don't don't touch that, Mom. Mom, wa wash your hands right now with soap, okay? The, the remote, please, do you see the remote? Oh, Cody, you didn't tell me you went to Mardi Gras. You didn't invite me. Look at these beads that you caught. Y yeah, yeah, those beads, huh? H how about that remote? Uh, oh, 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 Cody, oink, oink, I found a piggy mask in here. Is this your Halloween costume? Okay, yeah, y you know what, Mom? I I'm just going to come over and find the remote myself. Uh, I'll be right back, Junior. Oh, dude, that Play-Doh was delicious. Well, you did choose the best flavor. Yeah. Uh, sorry about that, Junior. I got the remote. Cody, did you just run 18 miles? Uh, no, I ran 9 miles and then I rode back on my bike. What? I thought your bike had a flat tire. It does. It actually makes it more bumpy. It feels great. Okay, so you can teleport the Play-Doh now? Yep, just gotta hit the button. Okay, yeah, do it, do it, do it. All right. <clears throat> Whoa, Cody, did it just teleport it? Yup. So it's at your house? Yup. Oh, oh, okay, so, so how, how can we prove it? Um, I, I guess if you hop in the teleporter, I could teleport you to my house, and then you could see. Uh, uh, okay, yeah, sure. Okay. Wait, wait, how am I going to get back? Uh, oh, uh, here, I, I guess take the remote. Okay, so uh, I just press this button right here? Yeah. Oink, oink, oink. <laughs> oh, hey, you Cody's little friend. I'm a piggy. Oink, oink. Yeah, I've known that for a long time, but, uh... Uh, I'll see you later. 
So is the Play Doh there, Junior? Uh, yeah, and so is your mom, and she was wearing a pig mask, which is really weird because she's already a pig. She doesn't have to wear the mask. I told her not to touch that. Cody, do you understand what you just invented? You invented the next level of transportation. Like, you could teleport us anywhere if you wanted to. Like, you could teleport me to Disney World right now. Well, I'd have to leave one of these at Disney World, but yeah. You should leave one at school so we're never late to school? Oh, yeah, dude. And you should put one at Chuck E. Cheese so we can always go to Chuck E. Cheese? Yeah, and I could put one in the men's showers at the gym so I could just pop in and watch all the hunky dudes shower. What? What? Cody, there's so many possibilities. So many. So many possibilities. Where should we teleport next? Mm -hmm. uh, well, right now, the only place we can teleport to is my house. And speaking of that, I think I'm going to ride my bike back home so it doesn't get stolen. I'll teleport right back when I'm done, okay? Uh, okay. Come on, Ken. Yeah. All right, Ken. You ready to go back to Junior's house? Ah. Uh. <laughs> hey, dude, I think I'm going to try the strawberry Play-Doh next. Oh, you should do it. That's my second favorite. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Cody, look! Oh my god, what? Dude, you look like a freak! Uh, Cody, you and Ken, you switched heads! Oh, dude, I'm out of here! No, Joseph! Junior, what's happening? Uh, I don't know, but it's like a big mistake accident or something! Ooh, ooh, uh, uh, oh my god, Junior, I'm perfect! What? I have Ken's perfect abs and his tight, hard ass! Junior, this is a dream come true! But Cody, like, what, what, what would happen? Like, what would make this happen? Well, you see, Junior, whenever we teleport, the teleporter breaks down our bodies into molecules and then reconstructs them on the other side. So I guess when Ken and I went through together, it, it, it mixed up our molecules or something. Well, how do we fix it? What do we do? Fix it? Junior, I don't want to fix this. I'm already perfect. I'm a god. But you, you look so weird. It's not your body. Uh, I don't care, Junior. This is perfect. This is what I've always wanted. But but didn't you say your old body was hunky? It, it, it is. But but it's not as hunky as this. Well, uh, uh, okay, so you're just going to stay like that forever? Uh, yeah, Junior. Uh, well, then what are you going to do with Ken? Uh, I'm going to dump him. He's too short for me. You're what? all too short for me now. Oh. I need somebody who can keep up with me. Somebody who's jacked like me. What? <laughs> yeah, later, Junior. I don't need any of you guys anymore. <sighs> what? Hey, dude, is the freak gone? Yeah, Cody left. Oh, finally. Cody said he doesn't want to be our friend anymore because we're not hunky like him. Well, forget it, Cody. Cody's a weirdo anyway. Ahem. Uh -huh. Guys, I would like you to meet my new boyfriend, Todd. What? Todd? <gasps> Gay. Yes. Yes, we are. Todd and I met at the gym. He was lifting 500 pounds, which was just his warm-up, so I walked over and smacked him on the ass as hard as I could. I almost broke my hand. What, so, so, so that's your new boyfriend? Yep. His nickname is The Jackhammer. Guess why? Why? Uh, because he's friggin' jacked. I mean, look at those muscles. And I know what you're thinking. Why does he bend at the chest like that? Well, Todd here can suck his own dick. What? Oh, uh, yeah. I've seen him do it. Can you do that, Junior? Can you suck your own dick? What? No. Well, Todd can. How about you, Joseph? Sucked your own s*** much? I never tried it. Yeah, well, Todd has, and he can. Dude, he's a doll. Oh, yeah? Could a doll deadlift 800 pounds? What? How about you, Joseph? How much can you bench? Uh, um, I don't know. Give me a number. I want to know how much you can bench, Joseph. Uh, 50 pounds, I guess? <laughs> 50 pounds. Todd can bench 50 pounds with his earlobe by itself. Oh, oh Cody, look, it's not about lifting weights. Uh, yes, it is, Junior. It's all about lifting weights. Well, okay, so well, you don't want to be our friends anymore because now that you have Todd? Uh, no, Junior. Todd is all I need. So... Uh, uh yeah, T Todd, Todd got done lifting 5,000 pound weights earlier today, so he he's very tired. I think we should probably just go home to bed. Come on, Todd. Let's put that chest to good use. I don't like the new Cody Joseph. I, I don't like him. I want the old Cody back. Right? What are we going to do then? We need to call a doctor to get this fixed. Okay, then. Hey, kid, you called the doctor? Uh, yes, doctor. So my friend made this teleportation machine, and he accidentally swapped heads with his toy, so we want you to put his head on his regular body. Do you ever just, like, have a cold or something f***ing normal, you know? Just like a normal disease, like a boo-boo or a sore throat or something? Because I have medicine for that. That's easy. But I, I don't even know where to start with this. Wait, so, so you can't swap the heads back? Uh, uh, what, what do you mean? I mean, I mean your, friend, your friend did this, so he can probably fix it better than I can. Well, well, like, well, here's the thing. He, he doesn't want to fix it. So you just called me to brag about your teleportation machine? Well, no, 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 no. Like, like, like he doesn't want his head swapped, but we want his head swapped. So we want you to swap the heads without him knowing. Okay, let me get this straight. You want me to perform a head transplant, which has never been done before, against someone's will? Yes. <sighs> fine, fine, yeah, fine, I'll, I'll do it. You, you bring him here, though, okay? And there's no guarantee that he will survive. Oh, okay, uh, we'll, we'll get him right here. Uh, uh, let's go get him, let's go get him. All right. 
Junior, somebody, anybody, please come look at this. What's wrong, Cody? Junior, look, he's about to do it. What? what? Junior, have you ever seen anyone so flexible? The human body is amazing. Yeah, t Todd sure is flexible. Yeah, yeah, he is. Uh, Cody, there's somebody I want you to meet. Yeah, just one second, Junior. Well, no, no, it's, it's a really hunky guy. Really? Yeah, I want you to meet my friend, Frank. Ooh, he's a tall glass of water. Yeah, he is a tall glass of water. Uh, me and Frank here, we're about to start dating, but I told him I wanted him to meet my friend Cody, so now he's meeting you. Mm, that's a big mistake, Junior. I steal hearts, and I don't give them back. W w what's that, Frank? Oh, darn it. Frank said that you already stole his heart. Yeah, I knew it was going to happen, Junior. Sorry. I'm just going to have to tear him up now. It's going to be like Sid from Toy Story. I'm going to strap him to my rocket. Yeah, and I don't deal with people who tap out. Todd here tried tapping out. Now look at him. It's like a pretzel. I need to salt that. Get some cheese dip. Mm, eat him up. Oh, uh, well, so Cody, anyway, uh, Frank said that uh, he has a surprise for you. Uh, uh, yeah, what kind of surprise? Uh, he said he wants to blindfold you and do stuff to your head. Uh, uh, okay. Yeah, so uh, let me get the blindfold if you're okay with that. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, oh, yeah. Okay, so uh, hold on. Uh, what's that, Frank? Oh, I'm getting the blindfold for you, okay? So uh, I'll be right back. I'm going to blindfold you, all right? Uh, okay, yeah. You hold that position, Todd. Okay, Cody, you're nice and blindfolded. So Frank... Is about to give you your surprise. Oh my god, Junior, I am so excited. Yeah, just stay really still, okay? Okay, so what do you want me to do here? Okay, I want you to put that doll's head back on the doll's body and put his head back on his body. Oh, okay, y yeah, 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 l l l let's do this. Um, l l let's just cut to it already being done, okay? Uh, okay, cut. <sighs> Junior, I haven't felt Frank do anything yet. Oh, he did. Hold on, I'm gonna take the blindfold off. Wait. <sighs> Wait, 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 Junior, what happened to my hunky body? Uh, well, I had a doctor take it away. Why? Because, Cody, with your new body, you were acting really mean, and nobody liked you, and it was just stupid. But, but Junior, I loved my hunky body. But, Cody, you got to understand that you don't need that hunky body for us to love you. We love you the way you are with your current body. Yeah... I guess you're right, Junior. I am pretty hunky already. Yeah, so you don't need that body for people to like you. We like you the way you are, Cody. And like, you, when you had that new body, you were acting mean and you didn't want to be our friend anymore. And I didn't want to lose my friend over a stupid body. <sighs> I guess you're right, Junior. Wait, 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 wait where's Todd? Oh, he, he ran off with Frank. Ugh, yeah. All right, well, I guess I still have Ken. Yeah, so you know what we need to do? We need to destroy that teleportation machine so nothing like that ever happens again. Yeah, you're probably right, Junior. <laughs> oink, oink! See, Cody, I told you your mom was a pig.